The Jefferson Nickel debuted in 1938, replacing the Buffalo Nickel in the 25th year of its production run. A design contest to commemorate founding father and third president of the United States Thomas Jefferson was held in 1937, open to all American sculptors. German emigre and American artist Felix Oscar Schlag was the winner. He received $1,000 for his effort. Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Coin Oz. In today's episode, we're delving into Jefferson Nichols minted in 1975. We'll be covering everything you need to know about their scarcity level, mintage, market value, and other essential aspects. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more insightful content. This video is based on article published by CoinWeek. The 1975 Jefferson Nickel is the first year that the design was issued after the passing its designer, who died on March 9, 1974. The artist got to see his design circulate for the final 36 years of his life. It would go on to serve 30 more years before the United States Mint updated the design to reflect an aesthetic first employed by the Mint with the release of the Sacagawea dollar in 2000. As for strike, many coin collectors are familiar with the notion of full steps. This refers to the sharpness and visibility of detail in regards to the steps in front of Monticello on the reverse. A grand total of six steps are rendered in the absolute best examples, while five full steps are still exceptional. In this graphic, you see that the steps, located on the design between the stylobate, a flat pavement section on which rest the four front columns of the design, and the foundation block at the base of the steps. Factors such as die condition, striking pressure, and incidental contact with other coins play a significant factor in whether a Jefferson nickel will earn the full steps designation. In MS66FS, the value of the 1975D nickel is approximately 200 US dollars, with recent auctions above and below that number. In MS65FS, sales records vary dramatically, though a fair market value for a piece is about $30. MS67 specimens are considered relatively rare. This MS67 superb gem fetched a sum of $2,812.50 at Great Collections Auction. Without full steps, 1975D nickels are common modern coins. Readily available in mint sets and rolls, collectors should be expected only to pay a nominal premium over face value. Without certification, which can cost as much as $30 a coin with all associated fees and handling taken into account, an uncirculated example will trade on online platforms like eBay for $2 plus postage. In a retail coin store, the cost might be less. Thanks for watching this video. This video is based on article published at CoinWeek. Consider subscribing to our channel for more captivating numismatic content. Until the next time.